Yeah, it's a film that um, I'd made, kind of, uh, kind of like a, a, a little play on these uh, movies where people talk about something that really affected them and kind of, you know, growing up and and trying to figure out who they are and whatnot. And you know, it's it's a little, a little like you know, tongue in cheek joke about that stuff. So. Uh, no, no. Um, I've known Cindy for for uh, quite some time, and um, she actually. Uh, helped me produce uh, a feature film I made a couple years ago called Mr. Sad Man. You know, like she had this script for um, a crossroad called Manzanar, and I'm also friends with, with Alice. And uh, we wanted to get it done and get it done well. And it was, man, doing a, a, a period piece. Yeah, oh my God. That's hard. Like, uh, I didn't want to do it. yeah. But it, it, was, it was good. It was fun because uh, I, I think, you know, she and I work well together. And um, like you know, we know our strong points and our weak points. So hopefully that uh, you know. Yeah, I know she wants to get that made into a feature film. Yeah, yeah. It it it, it was uh, you know I made it a few years back. Um, it's something I actually wrote when I still lived in San Francisco, and I didn't know anything about um, L.A. or whatever. So um, it's a film takes place in 1990. It's about a Saddam Hussein double who loses his job and moves to Los Angeles and then he finds out Saddam Hussein is this bad guy he's kind of like this sheltered childlike figure and um, he finds out he's a bad guy and uh, he swears off being Saddam Hussein but he doesn't really know how to be anybody else so he spends his time kind of uh, going through uh, American pop culture trying to figure out who he can be because all he wants is that adoration but he doesn't know how to get it so it's kind of like this hyper real like social critique that I uh, am doing so um, yeah made that a few years back right um, I'm right now I'm actually uh, doing some stuff with my friend uh, Steve DiBianco and um, it's called the National Film Society so what we do is kind of like we, we make videos uh, weekly and then we also show short films um, short films that, that we like and um, it's something where I think you know we can help people kind of put their stuff up and bring films that have already gone through the festival circuit or films that have uh, almost the way that, that kind of like, like Spunk uh, was kind of brought back, like bring people's stuff back and help support and create like community and, uh, and uh, really put work that, like good work out that we think has been kind of uh, glossed over. There's a, a I'm, I'm working on my second feature for next year. It's called uh, Be a Man, and um, it's a film that essentially kind of deals with uh, uh, the role of um, infidelity in in manhood, and how that's kind of like a defining factor in manhood. It's a dark comedy. I was say, <laughs> so.